you should buy an ETF that focuses on uranium. Uh, this is because nuclear power is the wave of the future. Nuclear power is the most energy efficient type of energy there is, and I mean that in a nuclear power doesn't produce as much CO2 emissions as other types of power. Um, so more and more countries, more and more places, they're going to be using nuclear energy, nuclear power plants to fuel their electricity. So if you invest in a uranium ETF, you will be well invested in the future. You will profit off of the country, the world becoming more green. And to me, nuclear power is a form of green energy. Okay. Um, nuclear power to me is the greenest type of energy there is. It's maybe even greener than solar and wind because solar takes a wide space to have the solar power plants. You have to like tear down forests and stuff to build a solar power plant. And wind power, you know, people don't want to see windmills on, on the on the views of the ocean and whatever. Um, I personally think they should build more solar power plants, and I think they should build more wind power plants. Uh, people are going to have so many complaints about solar and wind that I think uh, nuclear power is going to be important moving forward. I think people are just are just nimby's on this stuff, and they don't want nu uh, they don't want um, uh, solar power plants in their backyards or wind power plants in their backyards. And you need so many solar power plants and so many wind power plants. In some ways, nuclear power produces so much energy that it's actually worth it to build them. It's actually worth it to build nuclear power plants, even though it produces waste. You can just put the waste in a big old hole and have it, you know, not, you know, not break down for millions of years. But you know what? Uh, I think that's still the most energy, uh, it, I think it's the most logical form of uh, uh, power plant to use because it pr solar power plants produce so much power. Okay, and people are going to start realizing this. Like they just shut down some solar power plants in Germany, and it's like, you know, you know, you got to import more gas from Russia. You got to import more natural gas and more oil and more coal from Russia if you're going to close down your nuclear power plants. So, why would Germany want to be be more dependent on Russian? energy resources. Why would Germany want that? And they closed down their nuclear power plants. Why would Germany want that? And to me that's just foolishness because um, the uh, it, like you, you, you don't want to be dependent on bad countries like Putin. You don't want to be dependent on Putin. I think Germany's going to wake up in a couple of days or a couple of months or a couple of years and be like, you know what? We actually want our nuclear power plants because they're they're good for the environment and they are um, it's good to uh, uh, it's good to not be dependent on Putin for resources. Um, you know, Russia collects more natural resources because they don't have anything else going on in their country. All they have is a big old landmass. You know, they're not producing YouTube's, they're not producing Netflix's, they're not producing McDonald's, they're not exporting their culture to the rest of the world, so they have to export their natural resources to the rest of the world. Uh, and, and you really want to keep importing resources from Putin? If anybody's watching this from Germany, wouldn't you rather have something that, uh, a, a form of energy that doesn't produce CO2 emissions? You'll breathe better at night, you'll breathe better in the day. Because you, you, won't, you won't get as much cancer from getting, because new, because because gas power plants and coal power plants and oil power plants produce cancer. The pollution from it produces cancer. It also produces CO2 emissions, which is going to destroy the planet. Okay, we're going to have global warming and climate change and tornadoes and floods because of all these CO2 emissions if we don't build more nuclear power. Invest in, if you type in Google um, nuclear power ETF or whatever, they'll give you a uranium ETF and you just invest in whatever that is. I'm not going to tell you. It, the ETF just has different resources that go into the nuclear power plant and the different minerals you need for it, the different uh, expertise you need to build a nuclear power plant. More countries are going to be building nuclear power plants moving forward. Um, 
It is the wave of the future. And the thing is, you get so much energy from a nuclear power plant, you can almost export the energy to neighboring states. So you make money producing nuclear power plants in some ways. In some ways, it can be profitable. Um, let me know in the comments below, uh, do you agree with me or do you disagree with me on nuclear power? Do you agree with me or disagree with me that uranium is a good ETF to buy for your portfolio? You could profit off of the green energy revolution in a safe way. It's not going to crash your portfolio. Um, and, it, and, and, the nu and the uranium ETF has been going up over the past, um, what is it? It's been going up a lot over the past year, the past three years. It hasn't gone up over the past 10 years, like 10 years ago, because the cost of oil went down so much like 10 years ago. People were moving away from nuclear power and uranium, but now people are moving closer to it as the price of oil and gas goes up and the um, people care about climate change. So they want to invest in uh, nuclear power plants because they want to save the planet. You know, there's all these environmentalists from like 30 years ago, like, Oh, nuclear is bad for the environment. Well, they're bad for the environment if you care about nuclear waste. But I don't personally care about nuclear waste. All I care about is climate change. That's the only thing that matters to me is climate change. Anyways, let me know in the comments below if you agree with me or disagree with me that a uranium ETF is a smart purchase to make, to profit from. Uh, please subscribe to this channel to be part of this community. And please like this video. It really helps the channel out a lot. Thank you for watching. Have a great day. Bye-bye.